Let's review the Nintendo DSi. I had this DS for at least six years. We can see that after all that time. The plastic grippers have broken. The DS can easily fall out. The screens look perfectly fine. The buttons sound fine and it feels fine to use. Now let's see the R and L buttons. They sound and feel fine too. The card is easy to put in and take out. I'm struggling because I'm doing this all with one hand lol. I don't know why, but something looks wrong about the charging port. Tell me what you think in the comments. The camera looks so clean and new. The DS turns on perfectly. The DS is sometimes unresponsive. The arrow buttons work fine. They are really smooth and it feels like brand new. I tried accessing the camera using the R and L buttons, but it doesn't work. Let's test the DS's game performance with Animal Crossing Wild World. The touchscreen mechanic works perfectly fine. Randomly, the lettered buttons work really well too. The arrow buttons when I walk around work really well to dot this is really good considering it's second hand. The headphone jack works well though quite dusty. The case it came with really holds the games securely. Once the DS is out, we can clearly see how bad the back plastic grippers have been damaged. Okay, this is not just me struggling. The DS is really hard to put in after I take out the DS. My DS came with the same SD card you see here. The memory is really good.
The only bad thing about the actual look of the DSi is that it has weird glossy stains. Overall, this copy of the DS is really good and well-performing considering the only game one play is Guitar Rock Tour. What other things should I review? Let me know in the comments.